What's up guys, Luke Nate here. Today I'm going to show you how to install factions for your bucket server. Uh, this is a very popular uh, plugin. Um, basically it lets you create in-game uh, teams, kind of, uh, for different players. And to install this on the latest bucket, make sure you have the correct download. Uh, this was last updated on March 14, 2012, so make sure you have a, the right download for the right bucket and Minecraft version. And just head to this link I have in the description and click download so you can download the plugin and hit download again and you can save the file and once you do that it wherever it saves basically you just want to find where it saves and then you can open your server folder and you can go into uh, plugins and you can drag it from wherever you have it into your plugins folder and you can go back and now just start your server and it's going to uh, load the plugin and once it does that you can stop your server and now if you go into uh, oh by the way it generates an LIB uh, folder and if you go into plugins it also creates actually let me delete that really quick it creates a factions um, factions folder and you can edit this stuff with uh, notepad plus plus so if you don't have that program um, just google search it and download it but as you see here you can change all this if you want I really don't um, don't really mess with this stuff too much, but obviously, if you want to, you uh, can go ahead and do so. But I don't really mess with it because I do everything in game. So now let's just start up the server one more time. Okay, so stop the server, and now you can. Uh, oh wait, why did I stop it? <laughs> Never mind. Don't stop the server. Um, I'm gonna go in the game and show you how to use it in game now. So let's open Minecraft. Log in. And let's connect to the server. And now that we're in here, we can use some uh, faction. So once you have it installed, uh, if you're an operator, you have access to all commands, but by default for regular users, um, actually, one second. Okay. So, uh, to uh, view the available commands, you can use slash f help. Actually, I'm going to kill these guys really quick. Uh, so these are the default commands. Uh, regular users have like eight pages, but admins uh, or operators have like all ten. So um, let's first create a faction. So F create, and now um, we'll call it test. So now I have uh, uh, the faction test. Now let's make a faction description. So description test. So now if I type in the chat as you see I get a little thing next to my name that is my faction name called test and now I can invite people to my faction so if, let's say I wanted to invite Joe Bob Joe all I have to do is type in slash f invite Joe Bob Joe obviously there, there is no Joe Bob Joe on my server right now but if he was he could do slash f space accept and join my faction and you can do slash f list to uh, view all the created factions. Currently, there's only uh, test, obviously, and you can uh, look at faction power, uh, which determines what you can uh, claim. I have zero power right now because I just created the faction. You get faction power by just being on the server, and with faction power, you can claim land. And when you have land claimed, uh, people can't destroy it. So let's try to let's claim something. Slash F claim. And uh, I can't claim yet, so uh, uh, I guess I'll have to generate power. But since I'm an R operator, I can actually set power. So, slash F. What is it? Okay, slash F power boost test. Uh, I didn't do that wrong. Boost. Uh, 
Huh. Kind of confused by this command, I guess. So, Luke to an eight. Wait. Okay, I'm confused about this command, but I mean, I guess you don't have to worry about it. Uh, you can also, I'll just show you that later, I guess. Um, but some other commands that are pretty useful are um, uh, set homes, so you can create a faction home for your faction. So uh, you can do a regular set home. So like if I set home here and then I did slash home, I'll be here. But what if I wanted a uh, faction home over here? I use slash f set home, and now I can use slash f home. I mean, slash f home. Never mind. Slash f set home. Now slash f home. Oh, I had to claim the territory to set it there. Well, this is really unfortunate because I do not have any power. So let's try to claim one more time. Okay, so now I claim some land. So I have a uh, this area of land that is uh, my faction. And in here now I can set. I mean. Slash F set home. So now I can use slash home and I can use slash F home. And this land is mine and no one else can break it unless they're in my faction. So now if we go to page four, um, I can set the ranks of people in my faction. So if there's someone else in my faction, I can set them a uh, rank like owner. And if I do slash F map, it'll show me where other factions are. Um, and if we go here, you can ally neutral and enemy factions. And ally means that you can't hurt each other. Um, neutral means you can hurt each other except when you're in each other's territory. And enemy means that you can't use commands in their territory. And you can hurt each other. Uh, and yeah. So that's what those mean. So help six help seven. Okay, so now some admin commands. Uh when you are an admin on the server and you um you want to go into someone's claimed territory, what you have to do is you have to do slash F bypass which basically lets you destroy any blocks in anyone's territory which is pretty nice and you can uh, with factions you can claim safe zones and war zones um, I personally don't do that but you can do that if you want um, for chat spy when uh, people are in uh, uh, their chat so slash f chat slash f chat so when you're in your factionally chat and I like type in the chat uh, as you see, it's green because I'm in my faction chat. If you have slash f chat spy on, you can see everyone's uh, messages, even if you're not in their faction. And then, uh, obviously, you can set power if uh, you do it correctly, unlike me. Um, I'm kind of unsure as to what they want me to do with it. Let me try a permanent permanent power test okay so now if I do F show test I have 99 power so now I can slash F auto claim I can claim a bunch of land now okay so that you can do the permanent power I know that for sure I'm just confused about the adding the power I guess but that's pretty much the faction plugin so if you have any other questions make sure to leave them in the comments I hope I helped you with this tutorial if I did I would really appreciate if this if you gave this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you wanted to, if you want to see more uh, tutorial videos on that I hope you enjoyed this video I hope I helped you and bye